good morning and welcome to Halavington where I'm here to attempt the Halavington 20 miler. Is the Hull Avington 20 mile race on what? Look, look at that sky. We've not had a lot of this in March. Beautiful sunshine today. Sadly, my fitness isn't quite matching the lovely weather. Um, for those of you who watch me on Strava and bits, I've been really struggling with illness, struck down with something that's wiped me out for a couple of weeks. So I've only been back running a couple of days. Um, Thankfully, a little bit bunged up in the nose, but other than that, doing all right. So the plan today for me is, this is a two lapper. So I've got all my kit to practice, my marathon kit, got my fueling. I'm gonna go out, I'm gonna do, try and do the first lap and just practice it and see how I'm feeling. If after the first lap it's just not working, I'm not feeling great, I'll stop. What have I lost? Nothing, it's a training run. Ultimately, it's just, getting me ready for Newport. Newport's in four weeks and the last thing I want to do is kill myself before I do that. So we will we'll go and see how we feel. Just try and get some miles in the legs. Start off easy. If I want to do like 10, 15 minutes at marathon pace, just try and tick the legs over and see how it feels. We'll give that a go. But ultimately I'm coming in with absolutely no expectation and if I DNF, I DNF. I just want to get out here and enjoy just getting back some race prep again. Um, like I say, it's just getting the shoe, trying the shoes, trying the kit, trying the fuel, make sure it all works. So um, I'll take my camera around because there's no pressure today. It means I can uh, feel a little bit more free just to film and show you guys around and what's happening on the course. So I shall speak to you in a bit. I'll go and get myself checked in. So what am I testing today? Well, it's going to be as close as I can get to my marathon um, loadout. So I've got the Alpha Flies on still the original ones, but they've only got like 150k in them, so they're still good. Got the Shayu socks to go with them. Shorts. I've got my Brooks shorts on that I've got the storage pouches in. So it's giving those a go to make sure the storage pouches work for the soft flasks. Um, so I've got a couple of soft flasks with me today. Each one's got two gels in and topped up with water. So half of those every half an hour should give me enough to get around the race. They just slip in there quite nicely. So it's making sure I've not got too much wiggle and shake. You can see they sit in quite nicely in the pockets. Just club, club vest with the star, club record holder. Um, and then just hat, buff, just general stuff, wearing my Garmin, um, which is doing me really good for my training. So, load out ready, weather ready, sinus is not quite ready, but let's see how this goes. I'll see you on the start line. Lavington 20 miler. Let's go! For those of you who've done
down the Grittleton 10k around here you recognize this as the finishing downhill and finish line's normally in there that's another playfully undulating run around these roads Grittleton 10k but we are about 4k into the Lavington 20 Right. Thank you. Thank you. I don't know about you, but I still always get excited running over motorways. M4. There you go. Not looking too busy today. 13 minutes on the clock. Time for the first gel. Drink from the soft flask. Let's go ahead and turn. Thanks, Marshall. Go, okay, just ticked over an hour. Just gone through eight miles. Running nice and comfortable. Got Robin for company. Hello. How's Gary? Yeah, you recognise Robin, organiser of the Hilly Helmet Challenge if you've watched my videos. Enter his run, when is it Robin? 16th of August. Be late there. Re late preparation centre. Yeah, be there or be square. Uh, yeah, hour gone, so second fuel stop. Okay, ten and a half miles or so. I'm losing my running partner, Robin's leaving after ten. Good luck, See you, Gary. Robin. Hi, Gary. Yeah. And I'm on to my second lap. Actually feeling all right. Just been running within myself. Went through 10 miles at about one hour 15. Thank you. So again, nothing crazy lap two. Just enjoy the run. Okay, just tick through half marathon. Probably can't see that too wiggly in about one hour 40. So seven miles to go. And again, just ticking over nicely. Nothing too energetic. There's a group behind me I can hear nattering away, no idea where they are. I can hear their voices in the background, but I'm on my own now. After losing Robin, but yeah, it's happily plodding away. Second loop's a little bit shorter than the first loop, so we're into the last seven miles. For you service station aficionados, there's Lee Delamere on the M4. Oh, we've got Burger King, Emma, Ness, Costa. Oh, I'll tell you what, I could go for a whopper right now. That'd be lovely. Thank you. It is not a pancake flat course, Rinty. That is for sure playfully undulating. But I like your signs to try and reassure us. It's not the hill we've just run up. Thank you. We're getting there. Here we go after about. Thank you. So two hours thirty-two. Just coming into the finish. Managed to do it. Got a crowd. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Thank you. Bling time. Whew. There we go. It's 
so there we go Hull Abington 20 survived wasn't wasn't the prettiest just ran nice and comfortably all the way through uh, actually didn't feel too bad chest wise coughing wise anything still a bit bunged up but on the whole happy to get a solid 20 miles in weather held out medal in the bag big slab of chocolate brownie picked up for the finish so I think it's just a quick change now and then back home for Mother's Day uh, big thank you to Darren uh, who's over there somewhere and Stampede Sports for a fab event I think everybody seems to be happy and buzzing they've all enjoyed themselves seems to have gone down really well nice atmosphere around the place so thank you to everybody I've enjoyed myself four weeks out from Newport Let's see what the next week brings and see how much better I can get before we start setting some goals. But today, tick, bit of a success. So from Halavington, Gary Mack, out. And why did we run marathons? So we can eat big slabs of brownie like this. Ah.